to describe RJ, I would say an overall artist. You know, I don't really have distinguished words to describe me but besides just being able to create. Um, but yeah, I started dance when I was around eight or nine. And ever since then, it's just been a growing love here with Letitia and Miss Jenny. So yeah, it just started there. For nearly nine years, RJ Anderson has dedicated his life to an art only some understand. When he's not in this mirror, he's in uniform. Stereotypes often keep boys from stepping foot inside a dance studio. There's always that stigma of males should not do dance or they should not at least do ballet. They could do hip hop because that's more masculine, so they think. But I feel like there is more masculinity in ballet or contemporary than any other style because it's just like, what guy do you see doing that? And to lift a girl in the air or to hold them in place in the air with the right position, like that's, that's more than I could ever, ever say for a, a, a male dancer. Societal norms prove to be no match for his talent or passion. The way that a song and the way that the words can move you is something that you will never feel outside of the realm of dance. So it's just like, that will captivate not only you, but as well as the people that are watching. The emotion that I can give you on stage is something that I can't do in a regular setting because I'm not like the most talkative guy, but on stage, I speak more than I could ever do in a real conversation. So I feel like that's what, what I like more about dancing. When he's not rehearsing, he's on the football field. Anderson's a high school junior preparing for college. Well, NYU is a very difficult school to get into. So maybe I can just at least look into that dance program, see what they offer. And I got an email maybe like a couple months later saying that I had been accepted with a full scholarship. They um, accept only around 40 for my program and like thousands go into it. So I'm just like, me, me, like out of all people, me.